Uh, it, it's gonna be embarrassing. A car full of chicks, and you got a car that sound like it's chirping at you. You don't really have the turbo. I just hope these ladies are be, you know, too stupid to not know this. Yeah. So basically, the caliber needs a front end work, two new tires, and now you hear this. Plan flipping testing. What's up guys? How's it going? That's yeah, me on my way to work in the Dodge Caliber. Oh. Man, I'm freaking tired. This weekend, and I guess I'm gonna turn to the second part of my tuner's reaction to a used Dodge Caliber because the repair bill was outrageously epic. And what I mean by epic, I'm only half of the way there on the repairs. Uh, is, how shall I explain it this way? Um, the car needed belt to be played to be replaced the alternator had to be replaced the water pump had to be replaced the power steering pump had to be replaced all because of the power steering fluid was leaking onto the belt and onto the alternator and all that stuff so all that had to be replaced plus the timing wheels or pulley wheels whatever you want to call them so and then had to be replaced because they were worn. Then I went ahead and paid for that and the dealership, which I had to argue with them because they waited a day to even look at my car. They gave me a deal on how much the car cost to get out. Then they told me to print out not told me but they print out a list of what the car needs which is new rotors and brakes and front end work so yeah that was epic I couldn't afford fixing all that right off the bat because I got bills and other things I had to do plus I gotta eat so the next upgrade and I forgot to add the old pan needs to be replaced because it has a small leak. It's small, but basically go ahead and take care of it while you have it as a trickle. So the next upgrade, which I'm going ahead and order, is front and rear drill and slotted. Rollers. Hey, I gotta talk to some people to see if I can find me some brake pad, front and rear brake pads. I see the ones for the front, but I don't see the one anything for the rear. So I'm going to have to talk to some people about that. And my question of the day is, what was the most expensive? car repair you ever did because I believe this is the most expensive because my Magnum was not nowhere near as bad in repairs it was maybe 400 there and 500 here then the front end replacement work was 700 then where whoever hit me on the side and left was the highest but I never paid that much outright at first when I got the caliber I mean the Dodge Magnum so that's my full vlog for today I can't
catch you guys later. And I got a topic to talk about. And I'll catch you on the flip side. If I don't stop yawning.